you upside that head. Flight all day, I really could. It's just so much fun. Oops, <laughs> we're needing a new frame then. <laughs> Flying so good. Look at that arm. What? What? How does that fly? Wow. What? What? How does it fly? How does it fly well? How does it fly 3D well? What the f black box magic stuff is in this? What? I don't get it. I do not understand. Oops. So they took a hit there. Nothing looks massively out of alignment. I can't, I can't see anything wrong with that at all. Yeah, that's, that's good to go. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> Okay, I got a slight wobble in. We have an Aurora back in action in the form of a Fyra 110.
There's definitely a few more grams on it. I am running a really bad battery. I like to start off on the worst one. Still got bags of torque. <laughs> oh, a slight wobble out of it there, so I was only really after recovery and to be fair the battery isn't great. So yeah, it's fine alright, it's stock PIDs, even though it's not oblong anymore, could probably be optimised. <laughs> At least that kind of rough and tumble isn't going to break my frame. <laughs> oh, we've got a DYS prop though. No, sorry, these aren't a DYS, this is the King Kong. So that's what it took to break one of the King Kongs. It's probably had a couple of little tumbles, three, three, four little tumbles like that. Not too bad, they certainly fly pretty good. Wow, hover point's like 2% throttle now. Wow. It's hard to, hard to see, that's climbing. Uh, it's, the, it's the second mark on the transmitter. We're running a 450 milliamp hour 3S battery. Oh my goodness. The hover point is just too high. <coughs> Low, sorry. It's like, wow. <laughs> A little bit screechy. Oh my God. Wow. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> the peards are definitely like off. You can hear it like going. Vroom, vroom. I didn't break one. I didn't break a prop. What happened to it? It's like it's doing some yeah. in, stuff. in flight. I could. You, uh, I'm presuming that's the, the PID is just off on that one. Because yeah, you can feel it when you when you let it recover and then add a little bit of throttle. It goes. Vroom. It really starts making some funky noises. Um, so if you just like cr racing, cruising, that will probably be all right. But I was asking it to do 3D, and I haven't, yeah, on non-3D props. Oh. Uh. With PIDs that aren't optimal. <laughs> so <laughs> that's not too bad. Didn't break a prop. Though. Probably leave off on the 3D until. <laughs> so I'll try a different setup. So if I can, I can put some uh, efficient two-blade props on that, that fly pretty well on on 3D. Um, it'll probably be a little better because it'll be flat down the bottom end, so it'll counteract that aggressiveness and it'll be a bit more efficient as well. <laughs> I mean, look how far I'm going up the stick to do that. It's like, ooh. Just re it's ridiculous. It's gonna. 
going to test the motor. They're definitely warm, but not hot. I've got a, a damaged prop there. Right, dude, hover this. I want you to feel it. All I want you to do is hover it. It'll beep at you, but that's self-level mode. Go for it. It's self level, you say? Yep, yep. Just, just keep it in the hover. That's all. Don't do anything flying. Just keep it in the hover. Give it a little mini punch. Just a little poof. A little poof poof. Yeah. Ooh. That's it. Little spike. Give yourself a couple of throttle spikes. Woohoohoohoohoo! <laughs> Don't do that again. <laughs> it's aggressive, isn't it? Yeah. When you just, just put it slightly past that 20% and it's like, vroom, just takes off violently. It's a bit quick to really fly into the sun. You gonna catch it? Ready? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it flies better in the stock frame. Quite a bit better in the stock frame. But it flies okay like that. It needs a bit of a retune for three S. Uh, presuming I'm presuming that that flip from the three yeah. D was that because it was it was on onto a an inverted which is gonna like kick it out and make it wobble a little bit. Certainly with that much torque. So I need to re re revisit the three D on three S with with some different PIDs, but. I'm not, I'm not convinced that this is going to stay in this frame for more than another week or so. That little A90 might get a bit of a play.